Vandar. Look at this. Oh, Frisbee's calling. What's up, buddy? Hello, Hector. How you doing, man? You know. I'm PvPing <laughs> right now. Good gun. Not really, though. It's like fake PvP because it's all track valley, so. What do you mean? All track valley is not real PvP. What? It's Why don't you play real PvP then? Well, I hit just hit random dungeon. Oh, Dylan. No good? I think, I think you should PvP every day for at least six hours. <sighs> that's a lot of PvP. I would get some good gear eventually. Well, that's what this is about. Until you switch to arcade they, full time. I mean, the random thing may have like seen my gear and put me in here. No, it's but probably, didn't. probably not. It was but this is definitely like a PVE type of because what it is is that you can take all the towers and like end all their reinforcements because that's basically reinforcements go down the more towers the opposite side owns, or you can also kill the boss. There they have there's like a raid boss for each side. That sounds insane. Mm -hmm. I don't think you should do it anymore. Oh gosh. What's wrong? Should I go in there? Well, I'm not really watching you right now, Dylan. Yeah, hold on. I, I could put on I, the live video if you'd like. No, no, no. No, I'm not going in here right now. We'll just, okay. Let's just hang out, and I'll PvP the guys that show up. How do you, how do you send live video, Dylan Hex? Oh, uh, I'd have to do it through Skype. Let me... Do well, it. no, I want to send you my video. Well, I don't want your video, because I'm not looking at your stuff. But I want you to look at my stuff. But I probably won't. Oh, oh Skype is such an evil, Dylan. Well, I declined video anyway. You were trying to offer it, and I turned it down. Why would you do such a thing? Because I'm, I'm doing stuff over here. Dylan. <sighs> I think all, all your viewers are asleep anyway. No, there's 38 of them here. Yo, what's up, 38 people? <laughs> so, you've been playing a lot of Arc Age. We were just talking about that earlier. It's, a, it's pretty solid. Yeah? Yeah. So, you've been playing it... You were playing it last night. Yep. Alliance wins. Are you Alliance? Nope. They well, of course Alliance wins. They're the best side. I think they killed our general. Whoa, you lose if you just lose a general? Really? Yeah, you, well, yeah, it's either Vandar, Stormpike, or Drek'thar when one of them Wait, dies. Is, is the general a real person or an NPC? NPC. He's, oh, that'd be really cool if you could, like, randomly be picked to be the general. No, no, he's like a raid boss. That's lame. Let's switch to Rift, Dylan. Right now? Yeah, right now. In the middle of the Wowathon? Seems like an inappropriate time. Well, you'll just, you'll all tap. You won't really. <laughs> yeah. Selecting off of it. Sure. Okay. Well, it'll be great. Don't worry. I'm excited. So, what, are you playing Arc Age right now? Yeah, totally. Nice. So, what, so what are you doing in it? How's your Arc Age life? Are you building stuff or what? Do you build a house? Well, I built Scarecrow. Uh huh. Which allowed me to Whoa, build. Whoa, look! Like... I'm all tiny. I'm a little, I'm a little paladin now. Well, <laughs> sometimes it's what we have to do, Dylan. <laughs> so when are you going to do a 12-hour Arcade stream? Oh, never. No? That's too much, too much pressure. You can't handle it? I can handle it. I just don't know if I want to. You know, if you, if you are going to pay for my lunch that day, maybe. So all it would take for you to do a 12-hour stream is be to, for me to buy you lunch? And for you to be on it for 12 hours with me. That's fine. And you'd have to show your camera once an hour. Oh, that's true. Well, I'm almost up. I'm due for my one hour showing. I don't know. Let me, let me get up real high. Let me take a look at this. I'm going to mine this ore. And I'm gonna, then it's time for the, the hourly webcam checkup. The face cam oh. checkup. Always be mining, Dylan. Always be mining. Getting that ore. Alright. Hourly checkup. What's up? 
we're here. I don't see you yet. How do I look? Oh, yeah, let me... No, 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 no. don't worry about sharing. You sure? Nope. Okay. Fine, then I won't. Uh... <laughs> I'm tired. Why? Just started to get tired right now, that stretch. Still haven't yawned yet, though. We're good. I'm, I'm yawning right now. Are you? <laughs> nope, not gonna make me do it. Sorry. So what do you think? Do I look look rough? Am I gonna make it? Uh, you, you look about the same. Great. You're okay, don't worry. Alright. So Frisbee, do you want to tell people why we're doing this stream? No, I think you, 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 you've been saying it a lot. I've been saying it a lot? Alright. I think you know what's going on. Okay. Well, you can just chime in about that. Okay. If you if you feel the need. You got it. All right. So actually, you know what? What we're gonna do? I'm gonna huh. I'm gonna re I'm gonna change the title to hour six. Whoa. I'm gonna restart the stream to put out a Twitter call once again. Wow. As I've been doing that every three hours, and then uh, we'll be right back and we'll talk about uh, what's what's going on with uh, why we're doing this. How about that? Okay. All right. We'll be right back. Boom, we're back, live on the internet. Wait, wait, you gotta wait for them to catch up. Well, no, but it, they'll see this. I don't know if they will, though. I think oh, they they oh, they will. Oh, they will. What if they don't, though, and then they come in right now, and it's all awkward, because I'm talking about nothing. Hello? Hello. Hey, sorry. I'm getting... What the... Are you muting it to hit your e cigarette? No. no. You. I got. I was getting a text from a future caller. That's not possible in our current state. All right. It's Dylan a frisbee. I'm Dylan. That's that's frisbee. Hold on. Sure We're here. We got. Hold on. It is. What are you talking about? We got Eric here. What? What's Real up? Eric? What's up, okay. dude? Hey. Up? Hey, man. How are you doing? Good. Am, am I too loud or am I good? No, you're perfect. Cool, cool. So, uh, yeah. Frisbee wants video, apparently. Yeah, just so. like, no, decline his video. <laughs> no, Frisbee. I, it's not bad video. <laughs> Hold on. I don't know what you're wearing. I'll share. It's, it's not even video. It's, it's my live stream of my game. Is He's it? sending a live stream of his game. I'm oh. also sending a live stream of my game, so you don't have to watch the, like, minutes delayed version if you'd like. Oh, that's oh. so helpful. Yeah. Okay. But what we're going to do right now is we're going to talk about what is going on right now. And what is going on is a 12-hour WoW stream. Uh, we're on hour six, halfway done, y'all, of the stream. And we're doing it for... Let me hit the... Boom! We're doing it for the Art of Fighting uh, art show and charity tournament going on this month in two weeks from now, September 26th to 28th, locally here in Albuquerque, New Mexico. 26 is going to be Friday. It's going to be the art show portion of that. We're going to have art from comic artists, from fighting game artists, from video game artists, all kind of artists, every kind of artist out there. Tons of art. It's going to be real cool stuff. Um, you can check out all the artists on the website for it, nmism.com slash AOF. Or, well, here, I'll keep going. <laughs> Uh, Saturday and Sunday is going to be the uh, tournament portion of that, and that's going to be live streamed out to the internet. Uh, we're going to have a fighting game tournament with Street Fighter, with Skullgirls, Marvelous as Capcom, Killer Instinct, Tekken Tag Tournament 2, and Blaze Blue. We're going to have I'm commenting that, Dylan. Uh, I'm going to be doing Street Fighter. We're going we're to have all kinds of local New Mexico and Colorado folks. Commenting. The, internet own the, the internet's own me is going to be there talking. Oh, uh, also, Justin Wong is going to be there. Who's that? He's a pretty good fighting game player. He won. Right. He won a big Marvel tournament a couple months ago. Uh, you were in that tournament, right? I, wa I wasn't in that Marvel tournament, but I was in that tournament. I didn't face him. I did not face Justin Wong or Ricky Ortiz or Angelic. Did you have before? At Evo. Well, I haven't before. But I will at the art of fighting. 
And I just want to let everyone know, I mean, the whole thing is going on for, uh, for charity. Uh, we're going to be doing everything that we are, all art sales, uh, taking donations during the tournament, t-shirt sales, all going to March of Dimes and Save Babies Through Screening Foundation, which work to help uh, babies and families with congenital heart defects. Um, so yeah, just check it out. You can go to the website nmism.com slash AOF. You can donate now or you can wait for the tournament and donate then. But either way, it's going to be a fun time. Never should check it out. Now we'll go back to WoW. <laughs> Woo! You'd figure I'd get better at that after this is the sixth time I've done this. Yeah, let's see that's, how you are. Good. Mm. I feel like this is like from here on out, it's only going to get worse. You know what I mean? I think I'm just going to become worse at doing this slowly. I'm just proud that you remember every hour. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't know. I mean, I'm getting... It's just, I'm in and out on it. You know, <laughs> sometimes it's a little late. Sometimes... There's also like... A, luckily, there's a clock in WoW. So I have like this little thing right here to remind me. Thank goodness. I could set an alarm, too, somewhere in here. See? Yeah. They added an alarm that you can set. Oh, this game has everything. Set it. Oh, set I could have set a stopwatch this whole time in the game. I didn't even realize this. Oh, you Son of a bitch. <laughs> I have it on. Start over, Dylan. <laughs> All right, <laughs> let's start over. All right, guys, so this is hour one. Thanks for joining me for the very beginning of the 12-hour stream. No, I have it on my phone, so that's something. Oh, so what's going on, guys? What are you guys doing up this late? Just watching you. Great. <laughs> Perf great use of your time. I totally recommend it. It's an alternative to sleeping, I guess. Yeah. Who needs that stuff? It's the weekend anyway, right? Exactly. What are, so what's the plan? Are you doing another battleground or a heroic? Uh, or? I could pop into another battleground, yeah. Alright. I th was hoping at some point I'd get to the fishing guy quests around here somewhere, but they don't seem to be coming up at all. <laughs> Do you have the salty title? Uh, I don't. I'm pretty... I'm getting close-ish to it. I'm kind of half-acidly working on it. I worked so hard on finding... What is it? Like Iron Jaw or whatever? Mm -hmm. Iron Forge? Yep. And he never dropped. I spent literally an entire day. That sucks. Like, like 24 hours straight. Not really, but... It's not even a... what it felt like. It's not even a challenge anymore, because Iron Forge isn't the populous city Stormwind is now. Yeah, for yeah, Alliance, yeah. so it's like not even that hard to do it as Horde. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was a rogue, so it was actually kind of easy. You just like oh. find a little nook and cranny that like people wouldn't quite spot you, and then just unstealth. Mm -hmm. but... Yeah, I got f I'm four achievements away. I got to oh, wow. get I gotta get Rare Fish. I have to win the Booty Bay Tournament. I have to finish the Dalran Coins. You just fish them up from the fountain. That one is a pain in the dick. Yeah, it's awful. <laughs> and I have to fish up uh, Mr. Pinchy as well. Oh, okay. And so that's... you've done the Stranglethorn, mm -hmm. whatever is that? Okay. Yeah. I've done a bunch of stuff there. I did catching the special fish using the pools. I got the fishing diplomat, which is fish some of, uh, something up in Orgr Orgrimmar and Stormwind on the same character. Oh, okay. Uh, I got the one where you have to get all the like the treasure pools in like Northrend. Yeah. So the achievements aren't character specific? Uh, some are and some aren't. Okay. Yeah. Could you do like the lore master, like explore Outland on, Outland on one character and then like Azeroth on another? Uh, no, like, I, well, I don't know. I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not yeah. sure because I did, I got them all on this character, but I don't know. Okay, yeah. I don't know if you could or not. I'll have to walk, I can log into another character and check. Which I was going to do that at some point. I was going to swap to my panda and level through Burning Crusade content. Yeah, go with that new sweet looking model instead of your old dated one. Yeah, and I can't... Blood Elves aren't even getting... Um, they're not getting anything in the expansion yet. Like, they don't have yeah, a new model. Yeah, you're telling me about that. Are they, they're going to update it though later, right? They will, but okay. as of right now, it's not in there. Gotcha. What game are you playing, Frisbee? I'm playing Archage. Are you riding a, a llama? What is that? It's so little. It's like a it's like a Korean dragon. Oh, that's sick. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. 
People on the stream can't see that though, can they? No. No. Okay. <laughs> it's exclusive. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's exclusive to being on the call with Frisbee. Oh, so, only because you choose so, Dylan. Um. So Arcade is like all like a player focused MMO, right? Like players craft everything in the world and stuff like that, right? Yeah, it's like it's like Eve and WoW. Ugh, I know. Eve. It's great. It's beautiful. It's all spreadsheets. No, no, it's way more WoW than it is Eve. It's just a okay, lot. Okay, yeah. It's it's just way more player handle. Like players so, do everything, kind of thing. That's legit. Like the economy is very well. Easy, easily. They've uh, free to play it a little bit, so it's um, um, it's not bad still. But you want to be subscribed if you're gonna play it. Yeah, yeah. And how is like regular like like questing and storyline stuff? Is that any good, or is it really not a good uh, about that? I think everything's actually really cool on it. It's just, um, and again, I bought one of the Founders packs, which which comes with the free month of play of Patron, as they call their pay service. Um, and you get special things from just being a paid player. That's you. You basically get to earn points while you're, while you're offline, where unpaid people do not get to earn points. So it kind of so slows like, people down. What do you use points for? Like, because it's called labor points, right? It's it's labor points, and so you just gotta think of World of Warcraft, except for every time you want to chop a tree, every time you want to fish or mine a, an iron, you have to pay labor points for it. Really? And and labor points are just your. You get them from being in the game. You get if you are an unpaid person, you get five of them every ten minutes. Okay. Uh, but how much does stuff cost? Right, but again, you got to remember though. Here's the messed up part: is that you get five from being online if you're an unpaid person, mm -hmm. if, but you get none when you're offline. Hmm. So how so, can you just like idle? <laughs> or well, the other, there's AFK boots. Do um, does does uh, so? Do you need it for combat too? So it could like you like switch between combat and no, it, it's only for crafting. So basically, just imagine any crafting skill in WoW. When you want to make a piece of armor, you have to spend labor points. When you want to pick a flower, mm -hmm. uh, when you want to build a house, you have to spend these points. And so, pretty much, it's not really... I've never really heard of it <clears throat> yet described as a pay-to-win pay game. Mm -hmm. But it's one of those games where they say that if you're not a, a monthly subscriber, mm -hmm. it's way harder. Or just way slower. And, th and that's just because if you're, if you're a monthly subscriber, mm -hmm. you get labor points when you're offline. Oh, yeah, so then you just build up a bank that you can just... Like, and as soon as you so, get back uh, in, you can do whatever you want, basically. Right, and again, when the the unpaid player, they do not get that. They they are... They have to be online. And again, it's only five points every, every ten minutes, I believe. And some things you build, they cost 200, 300 points. So you just... Yeah, you just gotta, so you just gotta remember that. Okay. So, like, when, if you're picking a flower, obviously, is the same number of labor points as building a house. Uh, right. And again, I'm still really early. The game just came out yesterday, so I'm oh. still really early early in it. Um, the way it kind of just is described in the tutorials is the more advanced you are in a skill, if you're a grand master miner, then the less labor points it'll take to mine for you. Oh, okay. So it's supposed to make up for it, but again, they say that just the, the big deal is that if you're a paid monthly player, you're getting labor points even when you're offline. And I guess they say that from all the alpha talk and beta talk, they say that that's incredibly huge. So like, yeah, I guess uh, some assuming labor points become a big deal end game. Uh, again, I can't. I can't talk about it because I've not been that far yet. All right, you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. But I, I, I'm still. I just. So what level I, are you? I'm 24 right now. And what's um, what's the cap? I, I want to say the cap is 50. Okay. So like now, does it work? Because you were kind of telling me you were like multiple class types in one, or it, it is pretty much just 
all basically all the WoW classes mm -hmm. except you can use any three's talent tree. Wait, what? So you can be a like a oh, you know you could be a, a healer, mm -hmm. the healer tree, the rogue tree, and the warrior tree. Nice. And you can be a healer warrior with a stealth if you wanted to be. Okay. So it, that it reminds me of Rift, actually. It, it's it's a lot like Rift, except it's more point based. So it mm -hmm. kind of it's kind of like early WoW if we're, if we're talking vanilla WoW, where it's more like when you hit about eighteen, you only get a point every two levels. So you're kind of waiting a lot mm -hmm. before using your talent points, and then the talent trees are kind of split up into. Uh, you know, you can't they're, go... They're predetermined. They're, like, real obvious what they are. And, what? Well, and they, and they take points to get into them. So if you want to be a rogue, you have to spend seven points in the rogue talent tree before you can unlock this special seven-point required talent, if that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Are you are you locked into a talent tree once you pick it? Oh, no. You, you It just costs... It co I actually just changed talents... You know, around level fifteen, it costs forty silver. Okay. So just random money. Uh, money apparently is a big deal right now. Or you know, again, really early game, so a gold is going for a lot right now. <laughs> um, and even myself, I think I have, I don't even have a gold right now, and I'm level twenty five. Oh, and it's all from spending it and stuff, because you got to spend money to plant trees in the stupid gardens and wait for them to. And uh, you wait in real time, which is kind of the weird part. That like, sounds man, that sounds super free to play. Yeah. So what do you do? Like in the meantime, you just play like bejeweled, like alt tab, and like. You, I, it's well, you could go like, out and quest, right? Yeah. You just. Uh -oh. I, planted, I planted these trees, and it's gonna take 24 hours for these trees to grow. So I can do anything I want before then, but it, it's still in my little plot. Okay. So I, not. I, sorry. Go ahead. Uh, not everything costs labor points. No, oh no, to plant those trees, it costs labor points. No, but like questing and stuff like that. Oh no, it's, it's only, it's, it is literally only the skill side. The, the, okay. uh, if you want to be a crap, the crafting side. Okay, because yeah. for, for a second it kind of sounded like, like, Farmville or whatever, where like, you gotta like, leave it alone for like, an hour no, until no, you can no, play no. again. It's, oh, okay. And the, the labor, well, and the labor points, if you get low, I guess. You know, if you get down to the 10 and 15 left, you know, some trees to chop down will cost you 10 points. So I could see it making you wait then, but currently, in the in the 24 hours that I played, I have 1,800 labor points banked, and I have no way of spending them. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah. So I don't think it's going to be a problem. Was this a Kickstarter? No, this is act this is a major Korean game. Yeah, it's been out and it's been on Korea for a while now. God, I don't know shit. Huh. It, it's cause it's probably considered one of the bigger Asian MMOs. So they just uh it's totally different though, and I still I've told Dylan this. I think we should do a uh let's play of the Korean version. <laughs> this is, is it... supposed to be really crazy. Like a compare well, and I, contrast? Yeah, they dumbed down, like, I remember, like, Ragnarok or whatever. Like, the yeah. level was way... It was so much more difficult to level in Ragnarok in Korea, apparently. It's... they uh, Really? Because it's brutal in America. <laughs> yeah. Well, the, the, I know the free-to-play aspect is completely American, so the entire free-to-play store is all American. Oh. Uh, and the Korean store, it sounds like it's way more grindy. Mm -hmm. uh, if you if you get that one, so they they did say that they they specifically took this job just to dumb it down. Gotcha. Or to Americanize, I shouldn't say dumb. Make it, it more accessible, because I mean, right? And a grind fest is maybe not the most accessible. No. And it, it, and it is way more accessible than the, from what I've read is in the Korean one. Oh, I bet. The, Kore yeah. the Korean one just literally sounds like. You know, in the American one, it takes 15 kills to get from level 9 to 10. They make it yeah. sound like the Korean one is like 150 kills. Ugh. Yeah, so I, that's and lame. Again, we, uh, again, we could definitely jump on a Chaos <laughs> server and get in there. Dang. Now, is there an American translation of the Korean version? or? <laughs> as far as I know, there is not. Okay. Um, but I still think we could risk it. Okay. 
And I know Austin and Phil, had, they checked it out yesterday and seemed to really like it. So it seems like a lot of, a lot of people are liking it. Uh, looks like chat's also telling me there's 120 class combinations. That's insane. Uh, that's kind of cool. That's a lot. Are there uh, raids and stuff? Oh, oh yeah, dude. Dude, I've been in, uh, there's an op uh, around level 10 to 15 for my, there's a Horde and Alliance, so I, and I'm on, like, let's say the Horde side, so I don't know what the Alliance side kind of You're feels. a bad guy? Mm -hmm. I don't know. That's not really a bad guy. It's, it's literally like the... The Americans and the cat people are in one alliance. The Koreans. Uh, there's and, Americans? Well, the humans. Who are Fantasy Americans. Americans. And then the, on the other side is the Chinese girls or the Korean girls. Uh, uh, you'll see if you... White when, people versus everyone else? Well, there's cats, so it's all good. Oh, well, cats are okay. I'll play as a cat. Um, and keep in mind that the, the, the four races all have individual perks, mm -hmm. and some of the perks are uh, crafting-based. So, oh, that's cool. It's just generally said, uh, be a human because they craft houses 15% faster, mm. or be a Korean on the other faction because they chop wood 15% faster. Again, uh, I think the cats can breathe water 15% more, so kind of like that combination really messed up stuff. Oh, like so they can last under longer water? Uh, right. Under water? <laughs> What does that do in the real game? In the real game, you're going to pick a crafting side, you know what I mean? I don't know, yeah. but it, it's handy for undead, I'll tell you that. No. And wow. But I, I really suggest on Tuesday, though, if you, seriously, it's free to play, get it. Uh, just because there'll be a two-hour wait in the server queues, and I think that's a really cool thing to... That's what it was in, MMO. in launch, right? Yeah, for you. Uh, yesterday it was two hours to wait, and you'd get randomly disconnected, and then have to wait two hours again. That sounds That's lame. Like, wow. Yeah. No, it, it was absolutely just like, wow. Uh, and then they got DDoS the entire morning. Oh, of wait. course. What's the point of that? Yeah, and seriously, for the, from about 10 a.m. to around 4 p.m., you were just getting randomly kicked off because people were DDoSing. People That's so lame. Are the worst. I know, seriously, what is wrong with people? I don't know. Really. But on Tuesday, just I, I just say get in, try to get into it on Tuesday or week one, just because that's the the best time to get into any MMO. Yeah. Well, it'll just be a shit ton of players everywhere. It'll be ridiculous. Every is it like every one of the 120 class combinations are named? I guess. Is that? It, yeah. If you pick, there's three, three again. There's nine or twelve. I don't really recall. Uh, talent trees. You could pick three of them. And uh, my current three, uh, I'm a, my class is a gypsy. Um, <laughs> my other class before level 14 or so, I was a, a cleric, I believe. Huh. And it makes it sound like you can switch from full warrior to full cleric to full but then, rogue. Like, yeah, I guess, you, what, how's gear work? Like, you're going to need a separate gear set, I'm I, assuming? You know, I was all three of the healing specs, which would be cloth. Oh, y'all share. It, uh, yeah. And it let me pick plate gear, so I don't actually know how that works. I'm just wearing cloth, even though, uh, just because it feels weird. So I have no idea if I can get away with wearing leather or not. So it's like Final Fantasy, where you can just, like, change classes willy-nilly? Yeah, pretty much. Um, they make it sound like, right now you have to go to a, a person to do it. Uh, they make it sound in their descriptions that um, they're going to give if like Rift, if it is another try-on game, you can just switch when you're out of combat to anything. Nice. Huh. Which I do think it'll turn into that. That's pretty cool. I like Again. I like to I play to Rift. Uh, Rift is a is a really cool game. If you if you don't want to pay for WoW or Rift is a cool game. Mhm. Mm for free. Oh yeah. This is the Empress's fate. This is the weapon that we came for? Is this a little tiny bug? Huh. Word. I thought you were going to do heroics or BGs, Dylan. Well, to me and these bugs are kind of, you know, we're hang hanging out. So. <laughs> He's just chilling. Yeah, I can go do another battleground. Fuck it, I'll queue for one. Uh, can you, you can... do, like, three on threes? Uh, I need a team. Yeah. Get a team. Well, it's a, I mean, you have to, like, sign up and... Do all that stuff like I, I you can't just go into a random team. Are you sh wait? Did I, you should check because I thought there was just like random arena. Oh, no. Dylan, that'd be hot. Uh, 
No. Really player versus player things are conquest, which okay. is which is ranked battlegrounds, I think. Mm -hmm. Uh oh no, you can do arena. Oh, but I see it won't let me. You need a team. Yeah. Bummer. Okay, yeah, I remember looking at that, but never actually clicking anything. I always hated arena. This stresses me out. Too much pressure. Ah, oh, that was awesome. <laughs> And then, maybe it's war games are the ranked battlegrounds. Oh, okay. But what's the point of, like, do you get more... Uh, you get you get conquest or whatever instead of honor. Or no, you get, uh, or no it's all honor now, isn't it? Yeah, no, there's, there are, there's conquest points. It's like two different ranks, like there is justice and valor, you know? Okay. Uh oh, I don't know, oh, I don't know what this is. Some goblin shit. No, maybe not, it's Wrath. Wrath of the Lich King? I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is either. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't do a lot of the battlegrounds back in the day. I will. I will conquest. Oh, this is the one that's like Normandy Beach, I think. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. There's... Oh, is this like you gotta go like to the workshops and build like a a ballista or whatever, and then is that what this one is? Mm -hmm. Fuck. I don't have a clue. There's like thirty battlegrounds now. In my day, there were three. Yeah, there's a lot of battlegrounds. Look at that. Warsong Gulch, Twin Peaks, Battle for Grineas, Temple of Kote Mogu, Silver Shard Mines, Arathi Basin, Eye of the Storm, Strand of the Ancients, Deep Wind Gorge, uh -huh. Altrak Valley, Isle of Conquest. And then... No, I want you to do a five-man now. Like a, like a dungeon. So do Shadowborn Keep. My problem is it won't let me queue for a lot of stuff because of my gear is not What about good playing enough. your panda friend? Oh yeah, I guess I could panda it up, huh? It doesn't let you queue if you have the wrong gear? If I don't have high enough level gear, it won't let me queue, no. Yeah. What? Really? I mean, you could, you could form a group with people and go into it, yes, the old-fashioned way, but you can't queue for it unless you have the right gear. Yeah, they don't wanna, well, they don't want to screw over people like with some crappy thing. Oh, because it's random. Wow. Yeah. But if you have people you know, you okay, can just go to the I... entrance and go in. Yeah. <laughs> so crazy. That makes total sense, though. I love it. I could run a dungeon solo because I've been meaning to, I need to do that on my do, do dude anyway. Keep. Is that still around? Shadowborn Keep. Shadowborn Keep. Keep? Shadow yeah. Fang Keep. Shadow Fang Keep. Shadow fa is it Shadow Fang Keep? Yeah, do I Shadow think so. Keep. I think it's, it's like a level twenty, right? Yeah, it's totally like a level twenty, and you go kill some mage at the end. That was my favorite quest. <laughs> All right, I don't know. It's like, it's like eight years ago. I do, yeah. I do not know what we're doing here. It's, uh, it's <laughs> South Under City, I think. No, no, I know what that is. I don't know what's going on in this battleground right now, except that I have a pretty sick turtle mount. Yeah, I think go to that workshop and like this thing. I guess. <laughs> so is this basically like the Wrath version of? Whoa. Oh, oh. All right, let's attack this dude. Uh oh, this is gonna go real bad for me right now. Does it let you? Uh, <laughs> R.I.P. For other things? Huh? Does it let? Does WoW let you lower your level for quests? No. no. There's so no. Uh, if you're like level 45 or whatever, it'll like scale you to 49. Crazy. Uh, well, like a, a in PvP. Rift, I, in PvP I, only. I've yeah, been playing yeah. Rift, and the, apparently Rift will scale you down to whoever's level you're get the lowest level in your group, and you get full experience even if you're a level 60. That's cool. There's probably some crazy math going on behind. Yeah, the scene. like I, I just can't even imagine. But it was super neat just to be able to like jump into somebody who's level 15. You know, your friend who just started. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that I'm not the only one who didn't understand what the fuck to do right there. <laughs> it's just a massacre.